Macca's guides. <laughs> Hey everyone, Maka here and welcome to a quick video guide. This is for a game called Peepaw's Farm and you can get a thousand gamer score in this in just about five minutes. The game is $6.50 and I'll leave a link in the description if you want to buy it through that to support the channel. Now over the last week I've been playing some of the easiest games of 2021 for a video coming out tomorrow. This is one of the only games on that list that really needs a guide. Now one thing to keep in mind is that there is a speedrun achievement so we're going to be trying to do this in under five minutes but if you follow along with the video you should easily do it on your first try now the controls are super simple walk with the left stick and interact with the a button that's really all you need as soon as you gain control of your character walk forward and go kind of up the screen to talk to charlotte hold a to begin the conversation and then just continue tapping a to get through it as quickly as possible as soon as that conversation is over a list of things to do will show up on the left hand side but there are also some bonus objectives which we'll grab start walking to the bottom left of the screen to find the pig pen Inside, you can find Boomer, which you'll have a conversation with, and you'll need to grab an apple for him. As soon as you're done the conversation with Boomer, follow the fence and end up behind the pig pen. Here, you'll find the smelly old hat. Interact with this in order to pick it up and unlock an achievement. From here, walk to the nearby crop field, and the first thing you can do is pull up 10 total carrots. So make sure you pull all 10 of these, and then you can continue up the screen for the broccoli and tomatoes. So again, once we grab the 10 carrots, continue along these fields, find the broccoli and grab six of these. You'll have to kind of pull the big ones out of the ground. Pretty easy stuff. And then just past the broccoli, there's some corn, I think, and just past the corn, there are tomatoes. So grab eight tomatoes total here. And as soon as you grab eight tomatoes, there is a scarecrow near the top of these patches. So interact with the scarecrow in order to start another bonus objective. And then what we can do is continue kind of in that same direction, following the fence. There's an apple tree in the back. You'll want to pick up an apple and then start walking back. Walk through the pumpkin patch and pick up one singular pumpkin. You can carry more than one pumpkin at a time, but there is a bonus objective to not. As soon as you leave the pumpkin patch, make sure you take the box of gadgets and then you wanna to continue towards the truck and unload everything you have. Once you end up at the truck, hold A to load it and then continue past the truck to the left hand side. You'll find a fence where you can find your second box of gadgets. So make sure you pick that up and we can now dress the scarecrow. Before you do that though, head south or to the bottom of the screen to the pig pen and feed Boomer the apple we picked up earlier. This will complete a bonus objective and hopefully unlock an achievement as well. I have a bunch of them already unlocked so you don't see them showing up on screen. Now what we're gonna do is walk through the crop fields towards the scarecrow in order to dress the scarecrow and spookify it. This is another bonus objective which should unlock yet another achievement for you. So make sure you fix it up. We're at about the halfway mark right now easily. Now we need two more pumpkins. We'll need to get the striped pumpkin but I'll leave that for last. Instead, go into the pumpkin patch and harvest one singular pumpkin. Do not carry two at a time and then load this one into the truck. Then on our way back, we will grab the striped pumpkin, which is a kind of bonus objective, which we will need in order to get all of the other achievements. So now we can head back towards the pumpkin patch and head kind of past it a little bit. And there's a greenhouse with a striped pumpkin standing next to it. Go and interact with this pumpkin. There will be a short dialogue, but after that, you will be able to pick it up and then load it into the truck and we are pretty much done the game. There's one more thing to do, which only takes about 45 seconds or so. So hopefully you are ahead of schedule in terms of the timing. As soon as you load the truck, go and talk to Charlotte and Charlotte will begin to have a conversation with you. You'll also unlock another achievement here. Talk to Charlotte and then begin walking back to the uh, pumpkin patch. Once you reach the pumpkin patch, you may have to talk to her a couple more times, but she will tell you about a big juicy eggplant that she needs for the farmer's market. So go to the pumpkin patch and interact with that unripe eggplant. Then what we can do is go to the sprinkler and use it and the, and the eggplant will begin to grow. It will grow quite large and quite quick. As soon as that happens, she will yell at you to stop watering it. So use the sprinkler again, but you will add more water and make that eggplant even larger and thicker. Wait for her to shut off the water and then interact with the thick eggplant 
in order to beat the game. If you did all of the objectives and you did them all in one playthrough and you did everything in under five minutes, you will get all of the achievements at one time. If you did miss one, for example, you took too long or picked up too many pumpkins, you just have to replay through the game and make sure you pick up whatever objectives you didn't get on your first time through. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video. A super special thank you to Zarias and everyone on Patreon for supporting the show and hopefully I see you soon. Peace.